go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, friends. Welcome to episode one of Corpse Forest, a seven days to die playthrough with me, your host, Skits TGPG. It's been a minute since I've been in seven days to die. Uh, and I'm excited to be back because we're playing an Alpha 21, the newest one. Um, it uh, made some changes that at first I was kind of on the fence about. Um, there's some changes to how you progress with crafting and all these other changes that I was sort of like, mm, is that really where they should be focusing their efforts? But I've seen a lot of gameplay. Um, I've, I've dabbled in it just a bit just to get my feet wet. And I'm not going to lie, that's 10% more damage against mountain lions, love that. Not going to lie, uh, I am starting to like the changes. Um, so what you just saw was the name of the point of interest pop up. And uh, it doesn't look like it has any ratings as far as difficulty is concerned. So it's probably either devoid of zombies or only has like one or two. <coughs> but we'll get to that in a second. Let's get our initial quests knocked out. Um, while I do, I'll explain the series. So what I wanted to do with this is something a little bit different. New alpha dropped, and I wanted to do another 7 Days to TGPG, but you can't really enjoy everything about an alpha update um, with only 7 days. So rather than do another um, 7 Days to TGPG series where I only spend about 7 days playing the early game and that's about it, I decided, okay, well, what if we, um, what if we just as a, just, just for giggles and shits, so to speak, um, what if we played for more than seven days, you know? So I said, okay, well, we can just do a seven days to die playthrough, but, but everybody does that. I want to do something a little bit different. So I said, okay, what if we made the entire map forest? Um, so there's no additional... Um, biomes, which means anything that we could get easily in the desert or the wasteland or the um, winter biomes, those biomes aren't available to us. We can't go mining for oil shale or anything like that. In fact, we're restricted to the easiest um, biome in the game. Now, that ideally would make our lives easier because this place isn't as uh, dangerous. But that also means the loot isn't going to be good, and we're going to be... Wow, this is a very large car. This is a very... Am I, am I crazy, or is this, like, really big? I mean, I get it, it's an SUV. Okay, maybe maybe not. Maybe I'm just seeing things that aren't there. But, um, yeah. So I wanted to do something a little bit different, so that's why we're here. All right. Let's mosey on in and see if there's anything in here worth grabbing. Hmm. Oh. Uh, nope, this place is a shithole. Looks like it partially burnt down. This guy had a bad time. This whole place is disgusting. Um, one of the things I like that they've done... Hello? Whoa. Ow. Hi, friend. Oh! Home run. Okay. Uh, yeah, they've added a lot of uh, features and graphics, and the whole alpha just looks excellent. For instance, um, there are pa paintings on the walls and pictures that aren't of random people. So that's pretty cool. I think that might have been the only zombie in here. Nope. As soon as I say that. Nope. Oh, having a rough time out there. Hello? Oh. Hello, sir. Whoa. Ooh. You slippery. Excuse you. Lay back down. Stay a while. Oh, I clipped his... Oh. Clipped his butt right through the floor. There you go. And... I don't, ooh. Books. So, this is how you level up in crafting now. Rather than perking into things, what you do is you... Um, you find magazines and loot. Um, and you read them, and... Each time you read a magazine, your skill gets a little better. Like, I just unlocked pipe bombs. I know how to make them now because I read enough magazines. Um, apparently. Pipe bombs are pretty easy to make. You don't need a lot. Um, right here. Oh, okay. You, um... You've looked cleaner. I don't know, maybe you haven't. Uh, you can hit through broken doors now, which is very exciting. 
or at least you. Oh, you have to aim at the. That's neat. You have to actually aim at the doorknob. Um, water's harder to come by. They changed how water works almost entirely. Medical journal, journal, medical journal. Um, so now you have to. Um, you have to loot water, basically. There's something you can um, craft called a dew collector that can help you gather water naturally, but you need a filter to do that, and the filter's only purchasable at the trader. And Ooh, walking through the corpse slows you down. That's good to know. Cool. All right, let's blow this joint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my goodness, the trader's far away. Well. Hmm. And we haven't exactly unlocked a lot in the way of map data. So one of the things I did notice is they've cleaned up the roads quite a bit. Um, the world generation has somehow gotten even better. Um, so I'm impressed so far with what I've seen. Um, and I look forward to really sinking my teeth into this. Um, but this series too, I think I'm only going to do about 30 days um, at most. Um, and the reason for that is I'm basically biding my time until I can start a Darkness Falls series in Alpha 21. And I have to give it time for Darkness Falls to come out for Alpha 21. I'm sure Kane's already busy. He uh, is the developer for Darkness Falls, and I imagine he's going to be pretty busy with the new Alpha coming out because he has to update the entire Darkness Falls mod. Um, so, maybe a hot minute before he's even before that mod's even ready anyway. So, in the meantime, why not go a little bit vanilla? Just for a little bit. Ooh, some iron. I don't need that right now. Traders this way. Some really pretty world gen going on here. New car models, obviously. Not everything is a Crown Victorian anymore, so that's good. Oh, here comes... Construction guy. Oh! That's a twofer. Okay, bye. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> there she goes. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, they updated a lot of the gore mechanics. That's fun. Um, so we're going we're gonna to see some pretty hilarious, and by hilarious, I mean gratuitously violent um, death animations, and I'm excited for that. I know YouTube's got a whole bunch of violence things in place right now, but I I don't know. This game, I think, is going to push that limit. Oh, lay down. Thank you. Ah, it's good to be back. Okay, let's perk in so we don't completely destroy our stamina. We have four perk points, so let's go rule one, cardio. Skull Crusher for the Sledgehammer. Archery for the bow. And... Parkour. Nice little mix. I hesitate to specialize too, too much, but something that's interesting is allegedly the loot tables um, for the magazines are influenced by what you perk into. So what that means is because I put a point into um, Skull Crusher, the Sledgehammer perk, I'll probably start to find the chances of me finding Sledgehammer crafting magazines slightly increases. And each perk point I put into that tree increases my odds of finding relevant crafting magazines. You see? So we'll see it in, in application soon enough. That's a traitor. Uh, the trader compounds all got updated, every single one. This looks like Hugh. Or no, maybe this is Trader Joel. This is Trader Joel. The OG man himself. Hybrid energy. How it feels to chew five gum. All right, we're here. Trader Joel's. Full, no money back guarantee. I love that. How is that damaged. Alright. Um. Nice. He's got crops growing. 
Can I loot these? No, of course not. Um. Cool. Nice little compound rocking over here. Ooh, I can search this, so I'm gonna. What's in the truck, Joel? Junk. What's in the workbench, Joel? Junk. Actually, very helpful junk. What's in the chem station? Junk. What's in the forge? Junk. I love all the new models for the workstations. These are workstation crafting skill notebooks. We'll read those, because eventually we do want to make crafting stations. They're very important. Um, sounds like we got a buddy outside. We'll deal with him when the time comes. New liquor pile uh, lootables. That's cool. Um, oh, yeah. And you get beer in them. Okay. Uh, name checks out. Very happy to see that. I uh, can't pick that up. Okay. Let's get inside. See, uh, see Mr. Man. Ooh, definitely take those. Uh, oil shale, I'm going to hoard covetously um, because we don't have a desert to go mine it at. Why are all the doors, like, half damaged? I don't know. Uh, ooh, nice digs, bud. Shotgun crafting. Bow crafting. Assault rifle crafting. I won't say no to those. What do you see? Friend. I don't know yet, Joel. Robotics crafting, I'll take that. You got lots of fun books to read. Trap crafting, okay. Hey, dude. Oh, they don't let you loot everything on the uh, trader's compound anymore. That's probably good. That's probably good. I don't need the brass. You can take it. I'll take. You can take those. Baton parts you can take. Rifle parts I'm going to hold on to. It looks like it uh, can sell them for right now. Thank you, Survivor. You're welcome. Check back soon. I get new merchandise daily. No, you don't. You get it like every other day. At most. Can you help me with my problem? Sure. Great. I look forward to seeing you again. Yeah, if you see me again. We'll see. I don't know. If you're doing anything like what Wreck did to me uh, season one, then I'm pretty much toast. See that red skull under the Powell residence? It means it's a tier one. And we're going to the Crow residence. Here we are. Guess we're going in this way. Get out trusty little uh, skull crusher here. Did we? Do we have any? No. Okay. We must exercise extreme caution. I don't know if... There's zombies up here or not? But if I were a zombie, I'd be hiding up here. I guess this is why I'm not the zombie. I hear a zombie. Oh, ah. And her magic levitating ponytail. Ah! This, the standing ponytail, I'm sure, is an oversight, but at least we have boots. That was cool. Hey, you know what would be fun? If I let you on fire. Oh, there's two of them down here. Yeah. That's what happens. And he dead. And he's being a butthole. What are you doing, my dude? Don't don't jump at me. Don't don't do that. Okay, he dead. Sewing kits are good for stopping bleeding. Um, for when we inevitably have to use our only first aid bandage. I'm sure that's coming. What do we look like right now? Ridiculous. Excellent. I was hoping that was the case. Okay, not that way. Sheesh. Oh, I'm glad there's no zombie in there. Because that would have been a tight squeeze. Guess I should put out the light, huh? Alright. Okay. Seems clear. I'm gonna eat that food. Because we're gonna need to. 
And I hesitate to use our water. But we gotta. So what's cool is, see how this fridge is closed? Once we take this, it becomes open, indicating visually it's been looted. Uh-huh. Oh. Just poured it. Whoop! Hello, friends. Can I have that back? Thank you. Ow! Alright, stop screwing around, skits. There we go. Hey, I have a skill point. Uh, a perk point. Let's put it into... Yeah. Since we're being sneaky bitch. This isn't... What? Okay. Where's the... Oh. Oh. Hello? Oh, That's a perfectly good door you just ruined. Oh, I killed him. Damn. Oh! Yeah, I scooched him right in. Cool. Very gnarly. Ooh! It's Christmas! Merry Christmas! No ammo. 762. 762. Aw, you shouldn't have. I didn't get you anything. All right. No lockpicks. Ooh. Workstation, four of them. Boop, 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 boop. Cool. All right. Howdy. Howdy. I did the thing. It must be my lucky day. Sure. Thank you. And here you go. You're welcome. I'm going to take the ammo. Uh, may I see your inventory? Um, do you have... You don't have a headlamp. Uh, the trader's stash is no longer a thing. Um, so what he's got is what he's got. enough for any of this. But we can sell that. And then we have 1500 We could buy an advanced bellows for our forge, or we could buy a wrench. Hmm. Or we could save our money. Obliged, stranger. Let's take another job. But none of them are close enough to do, so we'll grab this one. And no matter what, I'm for everything you've done. Oh, you're too much, Joel. Flattery will get you everywhere. Gotta say... There's definitely, uh... There's a different vibe to this game than there has been in previous alphas. It just, it looks... There's probably a dog over there, I gotta be careful. Um, it just looks... fresh. Which I guess was sort of the goal. But, uh, man, where am I gonna live? I'll deal with you in a minute, sir. Ooh, there's a chicken I wanna kill. Excuse me. Ow! God! Actually, I gotta kill Method Jim over here first. Come on. Last arrow. Are you kidding me? Okay, well. I'm out of... Well, I'm not going to use a 7.62 round. And I'm not going to catch that chicken the way I am right now. Uh, no, living in a trailer is a horrible idea. Cool. Anything else? Dick's Diner. Let's do Dick's Diner. Why not? Looks like a nice enough establishment. Hello? 
That's not a... Okay. Oh! I guess that seat's taken. Hi, friend. You don't have legs. Coffee? Meh. Anything good in the drawers? Some coin. I'll take it. Huh? <laughs> I'm glad I chose Sledgehammer for the weapon. I know I did it the last two seasons, but it's just so satisfying. Hello? Well, oh, sorry, I didn't know it was occupied. I guess it isn't. Okay. Must be outside. Yep. Okay. Murky water. Take the cooking pot. Rotten flesh. Don't know that I need that necessarily. Whoops! Hi! Spear hunter. Sure. Robotic scrap. Whoop! Hi! There, big fella. Can you lay down? I guess not. Oh! Okay, all right. I guess I gotta get a little squirrely. That's fine. Ooh, that was rude. <laughs> Boop. Boop. Ow, that was not well-timed. Man, you can take a beating. And now he dead dead. Okay. Shotguns do 10% more damage. Pep. Medical crafting times two. We can scrap those. Actually, we'll hold on to them. We can sell the fort bites to Joel. What's in the mic? Row wave. Rotten flesh. Some more canned food, please. Ooh. Improves food crafting. I guess we'll take the coffee beans. What the hell? Uh, apple blueberry pie. That'll come in handy later. What's in the fridge? Animal fat. I can honestly say that never in my entire life have I opened a fridge and found animal fat in it. Perhaps I'm just not cultured enough, but uh, that's not... I'm not familiar with that experience. Cool. And it's getting late, but uh, it looks like... Oh. Wow, they completely blew out my uh, back door here. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> I'm 12 years old. Let's get a door built. Oh, they've got double doors now? Excuse you? That's most excellent. Um, yeah, that's the way to do it. You can't upgrade. We don't have another door. They've changed how upgrading and everything works, too, so that's fine. Nice. So they add the visuals when you uh, add the different tools for the workstation. That's pretty freaking rad. Pretty freaking rad. Okay. Um, do we have any perk points yet unspent? We do. We have one. Dare I go into Master Chef? What does that do? Find more cooking magazines. It doesn't unlock recipes anymore. 20% um, less cooked, 40% faster. That's not bad. I think I just want to put this, just put it straight into, yeah, intellect. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I'll use this wooden crate as storage. Why not? Hey. There's a roof to this place. Hello? <gasps> Hi. Oh yeah, you can straight up drop into... Cool, okay. 
That's about it. That's all she wrote for this place. That's okay. Guys, thanks so much for joining me today. I hope you had as much fun as I did. I look forward to seeing everything Alpha 21 has to offer. Um, it's a pretty robust update, and I'm excited to really see it through and see all the different features with you guys. Um, so I will catch you guys all at the start of Episode 2, but in the meantime... What was that? Food crafting? Okay. I'm going to go feed myself. You guys, take care of yourselves. Bye.